Hey friends, this is Ashley, Catawba Science Center's AmeriCorps member. Today we're taking a stroll around the neighborhood and I have found something so cool in this tree to share with you. So we're gonna spin it around and check it out. Are you ready? We're gonna zoom in a bit. Okay, do we see this cool tent looking thing made of webs up in the tree with something crawling across it? Okay, so this is a nest of an eastern tent caterpillar. So as you can see, they have what looks like a tent that they live in. They can hide in there if it's too hot, too cold, if it's raining, if there's predators around. If we go up here, there is another one right above us. Do you see all those cute little critters running around? Okay, so they are going to hatch around the beginning of March when the buds first come out of the tree. Okay, they're waiting for all these leaves to pop out. They really prefer fruit trees, so like apple trees, pear trees, crab apples, cherries. Um, they can be kind of destructive and take over the whole tree by defoliating it, but the tree is really good at surviving too, so it's just gonna pop out a whole new set of leaves. So no big deal, it'll be okay. But there's even more that I must show you. So let's climb down. We're gonna get a close up. Are you ready for this? Here they are. Okay, we're gonna go a little higher in the tree. Oh, oh, there they are. Tons more. Oh, 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 look at this. So when they feel a little unsafe, they will twitch their heads back and forth like this to kind of look intimidating and scare me off. I'm not gonna touch them and bother them, but I am going to keep filming for you guys. Do you see that white string going up the tree there? This is the coolest thing. It's a trail that they have made. Okay, they make two different types of trails. One is an exploratory trail, um, if they're just out looking for food. But then, once they find a new food source, like a new set of leaves, they're gonna lay down a recruitment trail. So they will put some of their pheromones down along that uh, silk-like material that comes out of their spinnerets, and that will tell the rest of their colony, hey, this is where we're gonna go to find some new food. So look at here, we got a guy or girl might be headed back up the trail to find his way back to the nest and down comes another one. This is the coolest thing. So I challenge you all to go take a walk around your neighborhood. Maybe you can find some of these little critters. Talk to you next time.